Hi guys this is Bilal Khan and you are watching Simplified Coding In the last video we finally learned how we can create login and how we can create an access token for the authenticated user Now the final step we will do is we will log out the user It is also very important we also need to log out the user So when we want to log out the user we will revoke the generated access token and doing it is again very easy so let's see how we can log out the user and expire his token so what we will do is we will create one more function we have sign up we have login and we will create one more function public function logout like this now inside this function we will log out the user so we can simply write to log out the user we can write request and as we need the request here we need to define the request parameter in our logout function so i will write here request request and from the request we will get the currently authenticated user now how do we get the current user with the access token that is provided after successful login so with the help of the access token we will identify the user that we need to log out so we will simply call request and then user and then we will get the token of the user that we have in this request and then finally we will call the revoke function to revoke the access token and this will invalidate the generated access token and that means the user is logged out So now we can simply return a message like user logged out successfully or you can put any message that you want. So I will put message user logged out successfully. And I will put the status code as 200. And our function is ready. We just need to call it from our roots. so we will go to api.php and inside these authenticated apis we will write root post and then we will create an endpoint as logout and then we will call the function that is inside our auth controller so we will write here auth controller at the rate logout now everything else is fine and it should work so let's try as you can see we are already logged in we have the access token that we got from here from the login endpoint and now this access token is valid as it is working to authenticate our hello world api that needs the authentication but when we want to log out the user what we will do we will call another endpoint that is log out and it is a post request and in headers we will pass the authorization token so we will pass the same thing that we have here like this and we will also pass accept application json because we are working with api and not a web application so we have all the things now we will hit the send button and we will get the message that user logged out successfully so it is working absolutely fine we got the message that user logged out successfully now let's test whether this api that requires an authentication is working or not with the invalid authorization token so if i send the request now what i will get i will get the message unauthenticated with the status code 401 that means unauthorized so our access token is invalidated or revoked so that is why it is not working so to make it work we need to log in again so if we log in again we will get another access token and this will work this time so if we pass this access token you can see it is working we are getting the hello world but again we can log out the user using the same access token so if we pass the same access token here 
user is again logged out and again it won't work so our system is working absolutely fine now the only thing remaining is we need to deploy our api project to our server and then we can use these apis to our android application we can also use these apis now but we can only use locally so that is why first we will deploy this api project and then we will start building our android application so i hope you found this project helpful and learned something that how to make authentication and in case you have any question or problem or confusion you can leave your comments below in case you like this video then please hit on that like button subscribe to my channel and share this video with your friends so thanks for watching everyone this is bilal khan now signing off